Now, for some countries, winning gold at the Winter Olympics is expected. For Australia, gold medals on snow or ice are tough to come by, which makes mogul skier Jakarta Antony's achievement even more remarkable, especially for people in her hometown. Greg Navarro has more. The Victorian township of Barwon Heads is known for its coastal beauty, some self-proclaimed culinary achievements, and now one golden resident. It's pretty incredible. I think that it's really cool and she's so young. It's giving us something positive um, to look at, something to smile about, something to celebrate. 23-year-old Jakara Anthony won the gold medal in the Women's Moguls event at the Beijing 2022 Winter Olympic Games by dominating the talented field from start to finish. Well, it's quite incredible, isn't it? For people who worked with the quiet, driven teenager as she developed into a world-class athlete, including Northern Bay College Director of Sports Stephen Lurie. Yeah, I've just got a new hero. Anthony's achievement is infectious. We spoke about it like non-stop and we've, we've put her up on the TV screens and, and, and the kids all know her now. Like, you know, and for me to sit back and, and watch the kids go, Jakara Anthony, Jakara Anthony, you know, like they all know her. It's a household name. Anthony attended the Barwin Sports Academy where her talent was quickly realised. There's a lot of pride. It's, it's been quite incredible. The messages, I mean, I received that many messages about the Sports Academy and their part. And then there was, you know, the school, you know, excited about it. And, uh, our athletes excited, the coaches, anyone that's involved in anything. Lurie worked with Anthony as a strength and conditioning coach. The gold medal, you know, is, is her, the person she's turned out to be, okay? And, and I, wouldn't, I wouldn't have wanted this gold medal to go to any other person than her. In a country known for its beautiful beaches and sunburnt center, to say that winning a Winter Olympic gold medal is a rarity is an understatement. In fact, Jukara Anthony now becomes just the sixth Australian to do so since the country first started competing in the Winter Olympics in the 1930s. It's an achievement as a, in the world, but as an Australian, it's another achievement. And then a rural kid from, uh, you know, from Bowen Heads, it's, a, it's, it's even more significant. Which has given this township of around 5,000 people another distinction, one that will continue to have an impact. It gives a lot of our students a lot of belief where they think that they can, they can achieve something special if they put their minds to it. For years to come, Greg Navarro, CGTN, Barwin Heads.